Frequent trips to the restroom can happen anywhere and often for men with an enlarged prostate. For years, various plant extracts, including salt palmetto, have been recommended to help with these lower urinary tract issues. Americans in the past were less likely to accept these types of therapies, but in more recent years, its uh, availability and its popularity in American men has grown substantially. Howie Rosenstein says losing his father-in-law to prostate cancer made him pay more attention to any changes in his prostate health. When I got to be about 55, 56, started noticing little things like having to go to the bathroom a little bit more, uh, things like that. Howie and almost 400 other men in the United States and Canada with moderate urinary tract symptoms participated in a double-blind placebo-controlled randomized trial. Dr. Kevin McVary from Northwestern University Feinberg School of Medicine and co-authors administered three increasing doses of salt palmetto extract to the participants every six months over an 18-month period. Regardless of dose, standard dose, double dose, or even triple dose, there is no influence on any aspect of prostate health. The study appears in this week's JAMA, Journal of the American Medical Association. It did not improve their getting up at night. We call that nocturia. It did not improve any of their urinary frequency or sense of urgency to use the washroom. It had no influence on sexual health, no influence on urinary flow rates, which we use as kind of a quantitative measure of improvement. However, researchers say the extract produced very little side effects. Men spend time, effort, and money on this type of thing, and if they're not getting a benefit from it, then they really need to rethink whether or not it has a utility in their life. Howie says he will continue to monitor any changes in his symptoms and urges other men to do the same. You need to find out what's going on. And if you procrastinate, it might be too late. So come in, address the issues, and get an answer and take care of it. Catherine Dolph, The JAMA Report.